Welcome everyone. In this video, we will discuss about essential and non-essential amino acids. So let's begin. Essential amino acids are those amino acids which are not synthesized in the body of organism. So we take them through our diet. 9 out of 20 amino acids are essential amino acids and they play very important role in building and repairment of tissues in the organisms. Their deficiency can cause serious disorders and also can cause malfunctioning or delay in the cell metabolism. Example of essential amino acids are lysine, methionine, phenylalanine, histidine, tryptophan, valanine, isoleucine, leucine, theronine. These are the examples of essential amino acid. Non-essential amino acids are those which are synthesized in organism automatically, so they are not required in the diet. 11 out of 20 amino acids are non-essential amino acids. They play important role in removal of body toxins and their probability of deficiency is very rare. Examples of non-essential amino acids are alanine, arginine, aspargine, aspartic acid, cysteine, glutamine, glutamate, glycine, proline, serine, tyrosine. These are the examples of non-essential amino acids. There is one more kind of uh, or we can say the category of amino acids which are semi-essential amino acids. These amino acids which are synthesized at very slow rate in the organisms are called as semi-essential amino acids. They only synthesized by body at certain condition like their deficiency or their need to for the cell metabolism only at that time they will be synthesized in body of uh, organism unless until if they are not required they will not be synthesized by the body so the example of uh, um, semi-essential amino acids are arginine and lecidine and they are a lot of semi-essential amino acid basically they came in the category of non-essential amino acid but they are also called as semi-essential amino acid they are needed in the diet at some time not always because they are only synthesized at the critical conditions thank you hope you like this video